It was a dark and stormy day, but I was on my way to the Tiara Chronicles. So it didn't matter because I was going to have a really good time. Today's meeting is at Linda's house. I haven't been to Linda's house before, but my GPS says in 4.2 miles I shall be arriving. Okay, here we go. Boy, I really feel like we're in the country. And it's only 90 minutes from where here I live. We are. It's Linda's house. We're just going to pull into the driveway. Sit. Okay, we're at Linda's. Oh. Look, look how I've been greeted at the hey, door. Piper. Oh, oh. Okay, they're so happy sit. to see us. <laughs> oh, and this is this is our host, Linda. Hi. <laughs> and there they are. We want full participation in this class. <laughs> full participation. And as okay. you take a wine glass, most the diameter of the goblet is usually the same as the diameter of the base. Usually, but not always. So what you do is you take a wine glass. This is a different, I think this is different than, yeah, yeah this, this is a different wine. one. You take the wine glass. And um, you're going to crack the stem. Now, if it is not, if it's too big or too small, you can compensate by putting lace or um, ribbon or, um, I think for clays, I put sand. I just covered it with glossy, glossy accents and then sand. Or maybe there's lace on it. I can't tell. Who knows? But, all right, so you get a brown paper bag because there are pieces of the stem are in here. So you get a bag. You put on your um, goggles, you feel where the stem is, and now, and you're going to break the stem, but the glass will fall into here, so you're not going to break the goblet part, right? So you hold on to the, hit the, hit the base. No, yeah, here well, it comes. you decide, you want, because yeah. it's okay if it has a little lip, okay. because you want to cover it, or you right. can dremel right. it, or solder it. Oh my goodness. Okay. That's because we're all watching you. <laughs> I won't look. Kill that glass. There we go. That was determination. <laughs> wow. So oh, you're that. good. And now this one broke off kind of low. But the rest of the pieces are in the bag, so you're not, it's not dangerous. And now this one is a little loose. So you could compensate by putting fabric or lace to, or to hold it to, to give it a little thickness yeah, right. here. And one I think I even did. So what do you do? Put the glue on the base and then stick this on. I did it uh, either way. Well, for the for one of them, I had it coming out because it was for a baby mm -hmm. shower. So I had like some baby fabric or something. I don't mm -hmm. remember what it was. And then I put a, a bead of glossy accents mm -hmm. here and smushed it around so I could see where it was and then another bead of glossy accents and left it. And how long does it take to dry? I don't know. Yeah. Because, you know, I go away. And yeah, then I come right. back the next day right. and it's right. dry, so I'm not like covering. But now this one, I think, is this one, this one even has a crack in it and a hole. But I thought that was okay. Yeah. You know, like, it looks it, like that's part just of the great. Design. You know, and then I did uh, decorate the outsides of the goblets with alcohol inks. Beautiful. Great job. Let's hear it for Linda. Yay! Yay! Yay!